Hi guys. I'm back now. How are you all doing? Are you doing fine? It's been a while since I last vlogged. What should I do for this vlog? So, I'm going to answer an embarrassing question about myself. And Liv already told my other friends about the embarrassing question, as well as sharing it on my IG story. Let's get ready. This is my first posting a question on my IG story, so I'm going to answer it now. This is question from the same person. I remember a question about OC while I was dance. I can't explain it to you at all. That's amazing. They never forgot that I was dancing during the online class. I can't explain it again. So I'll just show you guys the old video as proof. I suddenly started dancing while the teacher was discussing with my classmate. Just wait till the end. I can't believe, she got me. I want to get revenge onto people. I don't want to watch the old video. Anyway, next a question. Yes, I have a terribly embarrassing moment, and I went to Pink Paradise Milk Tea with my friend. She thought I was checking out guys, share of my life and anything, when she made fun of me, giving me a hard time. I chatting with her when she said, no worries, I'll just tell my close friend. She's the worst when she embarrasses me. Yes, that's me, haha. <laughs> to be honest, I was feeling bored at home because my phone was charging when I suddenly noticed myself in the mirror and something like this happened. And as I gazed at my reflection, I started imagining things that she asked, do you remember what happened? And I was like, trying to forget it because I feel like a imaging earlier. Next. This is the second message on IG. What do I need to remember about what happened? I don't remember about happening. Sorry, girl. I remember. I met her in the Ulet Mart a while ago, and I needed to use the restroom. While I was focused on checking my phone, I accidentally walked into the men's room. Suddenly, a guy stood up, and I looked up to realize mistake, which shocked me. And I quickly turned around and walked into the female's room, feeling embarrassed, because I had almost entered the male's room earlier.
Never forget, I suddenly tripped on the ground when my crush noticed me, and I felt embarrassed since it had been us neighbors since GHEs. Biggest fear? Embarrassing? That's online class while I was dancing and she recorded of me. Then teacher said, why are you dancing like that? I haven't finished discussing yet. And I was like bit panicked. <laughs> oh, I remember when my friend invited me to her birthday celebration at the swimming pool as we were playing with our friends in the pool, I suddenly felt the need to fart. I tried to stifle a laugh, pretending everything was normal, knowing they couldn't hear underwater. However, just as I let out a nervous smile, her little brother unexpectedly turned toward me, catching me off guard and causing me to blush with embarrassment. To be honest, I couldn't tell them that's why. Dude, that's so nice for you. Yes. Live experienced drooling before. I vividly remember one time when we were driving to a faraway crutch, and I must have been sound asleep in the car the whole way there. Suddenly, the car window opened as sunlight streamed and I blinked open, and I noticed the kid watching me, his mouth wiping gestures unmistakable. In the moment, realization flooded over me, and embarrassment tinged my cheeks. They haven't called me to wake up since I was kid to now, without interruption. I always sleep in that car. As I noticed, my old friend among the neighbors eagerly waved at her, but she didn't reciprocate. Despite our childhood connection, she seemed engrossing and chatting with someone else. But I feel embarrassed and disappointed. I quickly lowered my hand, putting on a pretend of being fine, and instead waved at the neighbors nearby. It's okay for me, haha. I quickly typed goodnight baby to my friend, but I realized I'd send it accidentally, feeling embarrassed since I usually reserve that term for someone special. Someone said, baby? Oh and I felt sense of awkwardness wash over me, causing a slight blush to creep onto someone's cheek. Ruined my life. Well, my friends and a stranger suddenly notice what I'm doing. You know that thing that happened. I felt embarrassed, like my face was adorned with spiral eye, and it's okay for me as I realized I hadn't checked the schedule beforehand. Wow, she's asking me questions, 
number from 1 to 5. Hum, I think it's never. In the classroom at school, I was chatting and laughing loudly with my childhood friend when I suddenly noticed him turning toward us. Realized my volume, I quickly closed mouths. Sometimes I laugh loudly, especially when I'm with my childhood friend who tends to have an even louder voice than mine. Oh, well never forget this one time when I was walking down the street, engrossing in phone, and simultaneously talking to, myself in sign language. Suddenly, I noticed people watching me, so I quickly lowered my hand, and pretend not to notice them, urging myself, to just keep walking and ignore any stares. I don't mind it, it's okay. Whatever, I try not to care, but sometimes I still find myself in embarrassing situations. I might have nothing to do with the subject of embarrassment. Oh, those are my classmates. I suddenly heard a noise and thought there might be an emergency. Then, the guys around me and suddenly noticed and pointed at me. I tried to maintain a blank expression, but I couldn't help feeling a bit embarrassed. Like this. The question from 1 to 5 are now complete, that's all. After using the restroom, they attempted to surprise me for my birthday. As I entered the classroom, I suddenly noticed a board with a picture of me. I was talking a lot when they didn't interrupt me, and suddenly they burst into laughter and recording of me, while I was oblivious to the chocolate on my tooth. At the end, they apologized for already recording me with chocolate on my tooth, leaving me feeling embarrassed with a blank expression. They made fun of me, Lamau. Stop fun of me. Alright, I remember and I have a proof that my video and message GC. I can't believe it. <laughs> oh, I think this started when I was kid, or maybe it was GHEs. I went there with my mom in the crowded place, absorbed in checking my phone. As I walked over to what I thought was my mom, I grabbed onto her hand. 
When she turned to look at me, I realized she wasn't my mom, and it started me. Quickly, I let go of her hand. Panic washed over me as I wondered where my mom was. Then, I saw her standing some distance away, waving at me. It dawned on me that I had mistakenly grabbed someone else's hand earlier. That's so embarrassing, never forget. Lamau. No, never. That's my cousin in messaging on FB. Lasty one to five. Question for me. All right. I was on the phone when I felt the urge to use the toilet. As I walked over to the door, it suddenly swung open, startling both of us. I quickly recovered from the startle and pretended everything fine as I walked past him to the restroom, though the incident left me feeling embarrassed. I and him are I met in that startle moment, and we both looked rather unattractive. <laughs> My friend had a birthday celebration at the swimming pool recently. The sight of poop and a goat no, I mean. Alright, the image of using goat poop to milk tea, with pearls inside, made me feel utterly disgusted. I don't think and, that's not true. I'm usually disgusted by certain images that come to mind, and I prefer not to dwell on them. Yes, last year and my childhood of trio and performed on stage for a dance. Because I forgot a step in the dance routine, I panicked and tried catch up quickly, but I still felt like something was missing. She looked confused as we danced. Afterwards, she asked me, you missed a step in the dance. I said, sorry, I forgot earlier and they quickly replied, don't worry about it. Although I was having a hard time and noticed, people watching us dance, I don't mind it. Oh right, some friends other told me. They said I behave like a giraffe like this. It's over now. I had fun, and I really enjoyed answering this question. Thank you for questioning me. So, hope you like this video.